So, Saints, it's Sister with a Testimony, and uh, we are claiming and staking the Rose Hill Cemetery. Uh, Sister with a Testimony and Sister with a Testimony Church Chat Granny. We are on the ground, on site, boots on the ground, and we are claiming Rose Hill Cemetery, which is one of the five supposedly most haunted places in Texarkana. We are claiming and staking this cemetery for the kingdom of Yahuwah. Yes. We are no longer um, going to allow the enemy to just wreak havoc in this place. Um, it is now time that we claimed what is rightfully ours and no longer allow the enemy of our souls to have any right to use cemeteries and 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 to be able to do what? No, uh, do you well, want to be on camera? No. Oh, okay. well, because I'm gonna I'm gonna pan around that way. Oh, okay. Yeah. So anyhow, I was just letting church chat lady know, know. so that she didn't. What direction? You know? You yeah. Going? What direction? Well, what direction are we going, church chat lady? Up and down, around, <laughs> in between, and out between. We're covering it all. I'll bet you that this place never has this much traffic until people try to claim it for the kingdom of heaven. No. All right. So, where did you um, grease up the ground? Right over there. Oh, I see it shining mm -hmm. right there. Mm -hmm. So, you want to read out that scripture, please, yes. ma'am? Yes. But as for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. Then it says, if my people are called by my name, will humble themselves, humble themselves, pray, seek my face, and turn from their wicked ways, then I will hear, hear them, them from, from heaven, heaven forgive their sins, and forgive them their sins, and, and heal, heal their land. land. Father God, we ask that this land be healed. healed. Here, if you will, give me the steak. Right there. Here, you video one? Mm-hmm. All right. Where's the shiny part? Oh, I see the shiny part. You see it? I see it, girly. I mean, yep, you me. can't not see it. We did proclaim white. We sure did. Thank you, Lord. We claim. And it's going right into the shiny. This portal to hell back for the kingdom of heaven. Yes. And God's kingdom and we declare and decree yes. that the holy watchers will be watching oh. even more so as people come into and out of the cemetery yes, with the spirit of um grief yes and heaviness yes and father god we just declare and decree yes that texarkana is being taken back bit yes. by bit, bit, by bit. and you said that you would deliver us little by little yes. because people don't understand father god mm -hmm. they can't handle it all at one time so as you continue to send us we're going to continue to do your work your will your way and uh i don't know sister church chap granny mm -hmm. we've seen some we've seen some stuff okay. today let me tell you sure we literally Went over to the Bowie County Health Clinic. The number one. And uh, yeah, tell them what tell them what was waiting on us. Three vultures. Where were they? Sitting on top of the building. And uh, when I told them to get off the building, did you notice how that one snapped his head over and looked at me, and the yeah, other one like, was like, "What are you? What are you? Who do you think you, you are? are?" But let me tell you what, when we went in that parking lot. Woo! One fell off. <laughs> he fell off. He knew what was going to happen. <laughs> he knew he was fixing to get mm -hmm. access denied. Mm -hmm. But no, it, seriously, you know, you're talking about vultures. Vultures on top of that building. Vultures are not going to be sitting. Buzzards are not going to be. Yeah, they're looking that, for some dead animal, dead animal. Or something. Oh, excuse me. Dead to eat. Dead. I didn't mean to about knock you down. Sorry oh, about you that. Didn't. Uh, but seriously, 
Uh, we tried to video. We had thought we were videoing for 10, at 10 the minutes. At stop sign. And uh, we seriously, we videoed mm -hmm. for like 10 minutes. And then it all of a sudden cut off. There was no video there. I know mm -hmm. I pushed the button. I know you did. Because we were doing it. Yeah. Right. And um, we literally seen mm -hmm. the buzzards when we drove in the parking lot. We seen well, the we buzzards. Well, when we stopped at that stop sign there on 12th in Spruce. Well, remember we were in the parking lot and the one fell off his perch. Well, we circled. You were videoing right. there. Then we went up and, and around. Down. And then when we come back around and went into the main parking, it's when that one fell off. And, and the then other when we were two, coming out. Other, oh, yeah, when we were coming out, they just all three took off. Right. And they didn't come back either. No, they didn't. And we proceeded to claim and stake. And it used to be a school. Didn't you say it was a school? Yes, it used to be. And people have heard children laughing and playing in the hallways. Well, that's not true. Why would that be one of the most? Yeah. The number one haunted place in Texarkana. It wouldn't. Something had to happen. Had some to children happen died. The children. There was a fire. There was some sort of something. bad something that happened Why there. Why would it be the number one most haunted? Well, you think about it. When you're dealing with um, uh, like Oh, let's see. There's a headstone right there. When you're dealing with death and destruction, you know, most people don't think about death and, until they come by a cemetery. But, you know, where do the people go? Seriously, come on. Where do the people go once they... Church chat lady. What? Where do they go after they die? Oh, either heaven or hell. But their bodies here, and we oh, bury yes, them yes, yes, in yes, yes, cemeteries. Yes, like this one. Yes. But do people even? I know they think that okay, everybody they went to heaven, and and little children are in heaven, and and ha ti ta ti da. But there's a spirit of murder and death that it, we have a right, right. to yes. put down and cast out and disagree with. And and you know you're dealing with. Young people in the cemetery, mm -hmm. old people, and old all kind of people. There's, oh, there's been so many, there's just people stacked up on top of people. But death is no respecter of persons. No. Okay, young infants died, old people died, and all in between. The war took them out, infirmity yeah. took them out, yeah. accidents took them out, yeah. like the Paragon Saloon. A wind came in, blow the wall over on them. And, now and they perished. Yes. There were so many. They fire. didn't. Yeah, they a have fire. A, 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 a grave out here with just all the bodies piled up in. Yes, but I don't know where it's at. I don't want to know where it's at. Either. This is one of the uh, ghost walk things on your Texarkana ghost walk is Rose Hill. This is one of, it's one of the n number one there's five most haunted places. Well, it was what the Bowie County Health was Center. number one, and I think Grim Hotel. Yes, and Union Station. Union Station. This place. Rose Hill Cemetery and the and the Miller County uh, uh, Municipal the, Auditorium. Yeah, yes. Now you tell me what I can so, understand the miss the down there at the um, municipal building and the and the Grim and Union Station. But I can't, I, I can't get yet why Bowie County Health is number one. Well, I can give you a little bit of, uh, shed a little bit of light on that. Um, anytime you're dealing with um, health, okay? So if we want health, the opposite of that is what? Unhealthy. Right. And it's a health clinic. Okay, yes. so it used to be a school. School. And they're saying that they have heard and all manner of uh, children playing in the halls and different things happening. Mm -hmm. So that means that the children had to have died there. Had to. Okay. So somewhere along the line, there was a death or could have been a fire there that we don't know about because we have to do the research. But if it's being called haunted, there's a reason. And now that it's uh, tied with um, the health system mm -hmm. if you look at the health system the symbol for 
the um, doctors and nurses and health system it's is a what snake. a snake, snake wrapping around, around the little staff thingy, right? And that comes from the Old Testament where the Lord told Moses to lift up that uh, brazen serpent, and whoever looked upon that serpent would be healed. Okay, so remember that back in the Old Testament. Mm -hmm. And uh, Jesus said, if I be lifted up from the earth, I'll draw all men unto me. Well, in our minds, when they looked, there was a plague. And when they looked upon that brazen, um, I think that meant uh, co uh, copper, copper um, serpent, yes. that statue, whatever it yeah. was. And they were healed. They they started, uh, instead of looking to, to Jesus for their healing, they healed. Uh, they're looking to a snake to heal them. And so that just always from day one that was a symbol of healing but we know that it's a symbol of death yes they, they don't even get it they didn't they don't. make the connection so when you're dealing with any health care environment their symbol is a serpent exactly that's pythos python divination Shining. sorcery witchcraft um everything that goes along with sorcery and witchcraft um promiscuous sex, sexual orgies, all kinds of uncleanness and evil and satanic ritualistic abuse. So one of the reasons that it might be one of the most haunted places is because there could have been some sort of death or bloodshed there, but we know that blood is being shed there yes. because people die there. Yes. Or they have died there. There's a cemetery across the street. It's yeah. a portal to hell. hell people don't understand that mm -hmm. they don't do the research and then if you tell them oh you know you're this or you're that no mm -hmm. do your own research, research. saints okay mm -hmm. uh sister with a testimony and church chat granny yes so we've had an interesting day very oh and what yes. do you think about certain individuals that I want know. to be delivered mm-hmm they like and they say thing. they want deliverance, but mm -hmm. then they keep returning to their, their vomit, uh, vomit like a dog. And two, it says uh, in his word that it's going to get worse. It'll be worse on him. Well, what really is interesting to me is how if you want deliverance, yes. you will be desperate for deliverance. Yes, yes. You will not be playing games with the men and women of God. No, you don't. So all I'm going to say is a dog returns to his, his vomit, vomit and a pig will return her to her wall. And you can't change the spots on a leopard. No, you can't. Holy Ghost can do anything. Yes, but Holy can. Ghost is so gentlemanly he is not going to force himself on anyone. oh no and no. you know what you can't buy obedience no you can't and, and and you can't have one foot in the kingdom in the in the world it's not going to work it's not going to work well we know what throne they're worshiping at don't we mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and it ain't a holy one mm -hmm. but you know what is so sad is when you toy with other people's emotions think about that yes toying with someone else's emotions that ain't even funny. I can't even get nothing funny out of that. Me either. I just have, sometimes I have a spirit of slap come over me. Ooh, did you get that from me? Remember, I got the holy slap a few months ago. I tell you what, I still Ooh. have the holy slap. Sis. I do too. I just sometimes want to slap the hell out of people. Because it is hell. It and is. I would never just go smack. Get and, and the it's hell done. out of them. Yes. And all your imps with you. Yes. But then, you know what? No, no wait a minute. Because some people are going to say, okay, that she's being ugly. No, I'm not. No, that we're not. Jesus had a spirit of slap come over him. Yes, he did. He had a spirit of kick, too. He sure did. Right in the church. Mm -hmm. He went in there and he said, this is a house of, of worship. worship. This is my father's house. And it is to be a house of prayer. And, and you've made it a den of thieves. And, and money had, changers. And my, yeah. See, look at, the look at the big... In the church. Now, money... Uh -huh. And that's what they're doing today. Jesus yes. is not coming into your church... No, he's not. ...building... No. ...without a spirit of slap up on him. That's right. And he will slap somebody 
And I ain't talking about physically. No. I ain't talk, when, I, no. when I say spirit of slap, Me I'm too. not talking about being ugly. No. I'm talking about I will slap you with, for being stupid. With the word. With, I got the word. We put the word Sometimes on Sometimes I them. just want to smack somebody. Mm-hmm. With the holy word. But you know what? I'm not going to apologize for having the spirit of slap. Me because either. Because it's called righteous indignation. Yes, it is. You no, know, they can offend. They now listen. Everybody can say, "Oh, I'm so offended. You well, offended me." Well, you better go well, get delivered. You got a spirit. That's a spirit of offense. It sure is. Because you know what? You can't offend the Lord, and you can't. No, you can't offend His people. And you if know what? Somebody talks to you and puts the word in you, then that should not offend you. That should convict you. Thinking, ooh, it but, should quicken you. But you know what? If they want to get, give me some kind of ugly something or another because mm -hmm. I got the spirit of slap on me, it's called righteous indignation. That's exactly. Now listen, I it's agree. okay for them to be offended, mm -hmm. but you're offending then my that, God. Yeah. You're offending me because you're offending my Lord. That's right. And I'm gonna stand up and I'm gonna say enough is enough. enough. And if I got to slap you with the word, I I slap some word on mm -hmm. them. Bring it on. Oh, let's mm -hmm. do it. But you know, you, have you noticed how we need to know this word? Yes. Oh, you know, we, yeah. Because yes. that, that on Sunday, uh, brother comes by and um, interrupts our worship. Yes. Just totally interrupts the worship, and I'm like, oh, I got the spirit of slap on me. Mm -hmm. Not him. For it wasn't us. him. It's like, hello, we're in the middle of worshiping God, and mm -hmm. you just stop what you're doing. And uh, so I take uh, responsibility for that because, you know, when we're doing prayer and, and we're giving out water, we'll stop the music and see what they want and, and take care of them. But when we're at church, church and we're having it's church, it's, it's different. It's totally different. And um, so I repented. I did and, too. Um, then guess what? He came back. He came back. And he was going to minister to us. And we're like, well, we're fine with you ministering to us. Go, go. Do you Come want on, the microphone? You, here you go. And guess what? It was a spirit of error coming out of that man. Well, every time he said something, you know, oh, no. Let, and we uh, get yeah. the word. Yeah. Well, here, here. Correct him with the word. You, that's how that's we That's the spirit of error. Error. Mm -hmm. Okay. And so I cast out the spirit of error. Mm -hmm. And then he's still going to go on. I'm thinking, oh, my gosh. He didn't get filled with the Holy Ghost. So he's no, going to he get a worse spirit of error. Mm -hmm. So, you know what? After that, I was like, oh, my, oh, mm, yeah. All right. You know what we need to do? Stay prayed up. Mm-hmm. Know that they're coming. They're agents of Satan. They, they are coming. They will be coming. used of the devil to try to keep us from worshiping and reading the word and doing anything. And we're just going to keep on doing what we've been called to do. What did he say? Sinless? Oh, yeah. That, too. I'm, I that's for another day. Oh, my gosh. I know. How do you think you can just sin, sin less, less? Sin less. Uh -huh. And get into heaven. You have to be sinless. You can't sin, sin less. less. Oh, yeah. We got to figure that oh, one yeah. out. Oh, yeah. Oh, my That's gosh. Mm -hmm. Seriously. Uh -huh. Seriously speaking, um, again, it's Sister with a Testimony. Mm. And um, we've finished our work claiming yes. and staking yes. every building and every... A piece of land that the Lord has told us to claim and stake. Yes, Lord. And um, Thank you. we are going to sow <laughs> Texarkana up with the Holy Spirit. Yes, we are. So it's Sister with a Testimony and mm -hmm. Sister Chat Lady Granny. We love you. God yes. bless you. Um, we're not trying to entertain you, we're just no. trying to inform this you. Is serious. This is serious business, this is serious. Saints. Wake up. Yes. Wake up.